okay welcome back guys today i will show you how to make a learning animation which will look like this as you can see on the screen uh, you can see that it will zoom out or you can say it will scale the ball after some sometimes or after some animation delay okay now let's see about it how to code the HTML and CSS. I'm not going to use any kind of JavaScript code for it. Now, if you have not watched my second and third video for this preloader animation, I suggest you to watch that video before watching this because it is quite simple after watching this video to understand this. Okay. And now I am linking the CSS file. To the HTML. Now in the body tag I am writing the main code. I am writing the div tag and giving it id loader. Oh sorry. Quotation mark. Give it id loader. And close the div tag. Now inside the div tag, we will make four balls, or we can say four div attributes or div tag. Now copying this three more times. Okay. Now save it and go to the css into css for the loader id we will say margin left of 600 pixel and margin top is 300 pixels this will rotate also this will this will move down our animation in the center of the web page or document. Now for the ball ID, we are giving the width of twenty pixels and height of twenty pixels. Now the border radius. No, we will give it after some time. Now we will give it margin, margin of flap, say 5 pixel. It is the margin between the two balls. Now we will display it in a block. Okay. Now we will use the ant child property. This will focus on the first child, child and uh, we will give it animation name zoom and it will last for one second and it uh, will be easy now okay and it's for infinite time oh and uh, give it a background color red Now I'm copying and pasting it three more times. Now for the second child, it will take effect after uh, 0.15 seconds and uh, color is green for the third child, it will Execute the animation of pop to 0.30 second and the color of the ball is you can say yellow. Now for the fourth child, it will be effective after 0.35 second and the color will be black. Okay. 
now for the keyframes animation name is zoom now at zero percent and at the end of the animation I say hundred percent I will transform the scale to one at the main position you can say and at 50% at half of the animation it will transform the scale to you can say 1.5 okay now I'm going to save it and open the brow open in the browser okay you can see I said give me some more margin to it I think let's say 10 pixel because we have given it more scale now if we open it in browser it will create a nice animation effect okay so that's it for this video if you guys like this video please comment or and like and subscribe this video and if you have any doubts about this video or any previous video you could comment down below okay thank you guys for watching this video till you